Hi, everyone. I'm Bob Rogers. I'm chief data scientist for big data solutions at Intel. And my mission is to put powerful analytics in the hands of every decision maker. I've learned that to be successful with, an successful with analytics, you need to ask great questions. I learned that lesson during my training as a physicist. There we go. I attended a lecture by Nobel laureate T.D. Lee. He was talking about his famous black hole theorem, and he explained that it took him months and months to figure out what question to ask. But once he asked the right question, it only took 30 minutes to prove the theorem. That was an amazing light bulb experience for me. So let me give you an example. Intel and Levi's have been working together to solve a major challenge in retail. By a show of hands, how many of you have had this experience? You go online, you find a product you need, but when you go into the store, no one can find it. They don't even know if it's still in the store. It's a huge frustration. It turns out that Intel retail inventory accuracy is only 65%. If that's not a black hole, I don't know what is. So let's find out how analytics can help. Alistair, I understand that you need a new pair of jeans That'd and that great. we've presumably got them here in stock. So come on over to my wired Levi store. We've got RFID tags in all of our inventory. There are sensors distributed throughout the store. All of that data is streaming up to our advanced analytics in the cloud. So we hope we know what's going on. Can you find your jeans here? No, well, there's only a 65% chance I can. That's right. Uh, but no, they're, amazingly, case, they're not zero. here. Zero percent chance. <laughs> I'm not surprised, and I'll tell you why. Our app is showing that the 501s have been misplaced. They're somewhere in the store, but we don't know where. So that leads us to our first question. Where are Alistair's jeans? Hey, Wonderful. <laughs> Narendra, do you mind bringing out uh, the jeans for Alistair? Excellent. Just the way these things hey, should work, myself. right? Thanks, Narendra. OK, terrific. So you got your jeans. And what we see here now on the app is that the jeans are back in place. The red light's gone off. Alistair, I'm glad we were able to help you and uh, get those jeans on. Thanks. <laughs> OK, so what you've just seen is Internet of Things technology taking data from RFID to sensors to gateways and all the way into the advanced analytics in the cloud. If you think about the entire enterprise, that's a huge amount of data from all the products streaming into the data center and capturing all the complex behavior that's happening inside each store. It's an awesome big data analytics problem. So, uh, what's interesting about the app is actually that it's not just telling us that the genes are nearby. When the genes came by, it detected them. But it was actually telling us that the genes are in the proper place. So let me explain by asking a couple more questions. So when we started the project, we asked, where are all the products in the store? Made sense. But what that resulted in was this table tens of thousands of rows with locations in the store, and no reference to whether something was misplaced. Well, in the store, things move around. Inventory changes. And frankly, if I'm a sales associate, I don't want to deal with that. So we needed to ask a better question. We got the tech team to share with the business team what they'd been working on, and we hit upon the right question. It was, how can we build a system that can actually learn what products should be together without any human input? Now, that's advanced analytics. And in fact, it's graph analytics, which is very easy to set up in our integrated analytics platform. Now we know where things should be because of how they're grouped. We know when something's been misplaced. And more importantly, we know where the misplaced items are. Hey, they're over there by the jackets. That's all I need to know. OK, so our integrated analytics platform gave us a place to iterate on the question until we found the right solution. Intel, over the last few months, has been working with Levi's to develop this end-to-end -end platform 
that takes data from RFID to sensor to gateway all the way to our advanced analytics in the cloud. It's been deployed in three stores so far and is on scale, on track to go nationwide. We're very excited about that. For this project, we use the Trusted Analytics Platform, or TAP, which is an integrated analytics platform that brings together data analysis and ingestion, data science model building, and the deployment of those models into production. It's a, uh, a, a powerful environment to bring all your analytics together. So once we had TAP in place and we answered our first question, then we discovered that the team was able to ask all kinds of amazing questions that they'd never dreamed of. Things like, wh what are the predictable patterns for objects going missing in the store? Or how do we build a new product based on the way users move products around in the store? In other words, how do we find new products that fit our customers be better? So for data scientists, for app developers, and for decision makers, that's Nirvana. Now it's your turn. Think about the question that you want your analytics system to answer. Think about who you need to bring into the conversation. And then imagine an environment where your data, your analytics, and your people can iterate toward the right question so that you can get the most powerful solution to your business problems. If I can help, come see me in the Intel booth, number 917. Love to talk to you. We have a sponsored session today at 11 in room 203B. And finally, if you just want to jump in and start doing analytics on tap, go to trustedanalytics.org. Thanks. <laughs>